All right, time to check in. We are at uh, just under 21 minutes here. As you can see, I've got some damage done. There's certainly a method to the madness. Um, let me walk you through this. Number one, I ordered, again, the, uh, the collard greens and the red cabbage. Nice sour, something that's gonna have a very different taste than everything else, because uh, let me tell you, the, um, the wear and tear on your palate is terrible. Now, the real kicker is beautiful about this competition. Number one, don't drink just water. I got, um, I got some unsweet tea in here. You don't want a whole bunch of sugar to get, give you some gut rot. But let me tell you a little something about Carolina barbecue. They use mustard bases and vinegar bases, not like molasses or brown sugar. So, first one you got here is a uh, golden octane. That's your mustard sauce. Nice tang to it. A little bit of sweet on the back end. Uh, Love and smoke. This is going to be more of your uh, your classic sauce on here, but still not overly sweet, not overly gunky. A lot of um, a lot of sauces come across like almost like a ketchup consistency. Way way too thick. All right, last one here is a. Uh, Carolina dip. Now this is almost a straight up liquid. This is probably what they put on their uh, on their slaw. Zesty vinegar barbecue sauce. Almost straight up vinegar. So you're not adding really any calories. Not like you're calorie counting if you're doing one of these. Um, but no more extra volume either. It actually makes it a lot easier to eat. Um, you also notice that I pulled the buns off and I got the hush puppies here on the end. Bread always comes last, which can be a double-edged sword because the last thing you want is cold or soggy bread at the very end, but believe me, you don't want that clogging you up on your way in. But uh, I gotta get back to eating. See you at the finish line.